I'm Melanie Raymond, I'm the Chair of the Board of Youth Projects. Yeah, hi, uh, I'm Brad. Uh, hi, my name is Sarah, I am a casual at uh, Good To Go. We started Good To Go not to make money, but because we knew young people were being locked out of the job market, we knew that there were few opportunities for them to get the skills that they need to get a job and they weren't being able to get interviews or build up a resume or even compete in the job market today. I came to Melbourne for a holiday and when I was on, on, the, on the holiday my house burned down so I had nowhere to go back to so I was homeless for three and a half years. Um, I've been using youth projects for eight and a half years. Uh, at school I was bullied by a lot of students, people younger than me as well and also parents and teachers. That was a big thing and I had teachers say to me that I wasn't going to succeed in life. I was diagnosed with bone when I was 14, so over the last 10 years it just got worse and worse and worse. I got into youth projects um, because of Centrelink. It was just one of the things I had to do to earn my benefits and it turned out to be one of the best things I have ever done in my life. I wanted down the lane and the place you could go, so I found here they helped me with showers, they got lockers, they got laundries. They got doctors, they got dietists, they got art therapy, cooking, um, mental health workers, um, mental health counsellor, a nurse. Um, they got it all. You know, this is the only only organisation in Melbourne that offer everything. Well, they helped me build my confidence up massively. Um, just being able to apply for jobs, even going to interviews with a bit more confidence and know what to say. I've just already got a second job as well, thanks to Good To Go. I think these projects save, they have, they've saved my life, you know. If it wasn't for these projects, I'd either be dead or in jail. You know, I wasn't just another person in the line. I was actually someone that needed help and they wanted to help. Sam, at least. So we need to change the way we do things. We need young people to get the opportunities that they can't otherwise get, and in particular, the young people most at risk. With everyone's help, we can really make an impact. We can get on top of this problem. So thank you for listening, and I, I know that you're going to want to get involved and that in your heart of hearts you know that you can make a difference.